Hello and a warm welcome from the English West Midlands. We find ourselves at Molyneux. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers versus Arsenal. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? At the moment, he's playing with great confidence. Every time he gets the ball, he looks like he's going to score, as his record in recent times will suggest. Three goals in the last three games. He's been brilliant. Have a great game. Thanks. Good game. Thanks. Cheers. Good luck. Good luck. Good game out there. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks. Good game. Good game. The initial 11 for Wolves. Ruben Neves plays alongside João Moutinho in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Aaron Ramsdale as the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Alexandre Lacazette. Well, this game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. And doing the manoeuvring is Lacazette. Nelson Semedo. Cody. And that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line. Podence. A fine use of the ball. They're trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Roman Saiz. There to take it away. Thomas Partey. Lacazette. Well read to ease the pressure. Chance to play it in. Neves. Wonderful chance. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. <laughs> and the short option preferred. Crossing into the middle. And still dangerous. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Lacazette. And Wolves come away with it. Jimenez. Trincao. Nelson Semedo. Moutinho did well to win the ball back. Party. Jacka with it. Advantage, Arsenal. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. 
I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. He's given it straight to the opposition. Marcinelli. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Well, the stats don't lie. It's been very tense and an even battle so far, but neither side has played with enough quality to pose a real threat going forward, and that needs to change. And the pass, a good one. And you need your defender to take charge. Electing to cross into the centre. No way through. Raul Jimenez. And he's clear as lines. And intercepted it. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Granit Xhaka. Thomas now. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, he didn't contribute enough in that first half. I think he needs to work harder to get on the ball. He was far too static. In my view, he's got to make more runs behind this back line in the second half. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Nelson Semedo. Moutinho. Podence. And dispossessed. Oh, lovely incisive pass. That is really alert defending just when the situation looked dangerous. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Parte. Chance to cross. But nothing doing in an attacking sense. Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. How could he take them on and beat them? Space and time for the cross. Not messing around with that clearance. Lacazette. Saka. Great effort to keep that one in play. Well shown inside. Really good challenge. For Dense. They've lost it. Martin Odegaard. Went in strongly, decisively. Martinho. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Trincao. Precise ball movement. 
And a tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Quite the tantalising free kick he was hoping for. Goalkeeper's ball. Fifteen minutes left for play. And very deftly cut out. Nelson Semedo. It's with Moutinho. Ryan Ait Nuri. On to Jimenez. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance, and the fans are lapping this up. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. A dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider they get forward but time is very much against them here Albert Sambi Lokonga Lacazette well, putting it wide from there a pity really Nelson Semedo. Trincao. Nelson Semedo has it. Jimenez. It's with Ruben Nervis. Crisp tackling. Albert Sambi Lokonga. So full time, it is done and dusted here and three points for Wolverhampton Wanderers. What did you think of their overall display? Yes, Derek, well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. On a standout performance, not for the first time from Raul Jimenez. Stewart, he dominated, he turned on the style. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.